Morning everybody. Happy Monday. This is Connie and I am here with another week of making it work for you. And let's just get right into what I wore today. The first thing I put on was my um, spackle by Laura Geller. That is just a primer. Um, that's all I wore today. And then I put on uh, my Brow Stylist Plumper by L'Oreal. This is what it looks like. Just a little, little spoolie, which I like, but I really like the longer wand on this. Okay, and then I used my Ulta Eye Primer. And I'm just going to go through what I'm wearing all week. Um, there will be one day where I sneak in something different from my make, from my project pan. And this is Smashbox X-Rated Mascara. Just a sample. And it is, uh, it's a good mascara. It's just really wet. So it just, I just have to wear it for a little bit to get it used to my eyes or whatever. Uh, Bodyography blush and I have no idea what color this is let's see if it says here Calypso and there it is just a really pretty I like bodyography stuff this is what the case looks like my highlight this week is the L'Oreal True Match Lumi in It's for neutral undertones, that's what it says, but it is in rose. And I just swirled my brush and through all of it today. A lot of times I'll just go in the really light colors, but today I just swirled it through the whole thing. Okay, for my eyeshadow palette this week. Now I have a dilemma with this eyeshadow palette. I won this. It was one of the first giveaways I ever won on my channel. And I am not so sure it's real. Anyway, let me tell you what I wore first. I wore this one in for my all over base. I wore this for my, my crease or my transition. And I wore this one on my eye. But the, see look at the mirror how, you know, it's not clear and it is also falling out. I might as well just throw the dang oh of course now it's gonna of course now it's gonna stay in now that I put it back in but um, it was laying on top this morning. I don't know how to tell the difference. How do you tell the difference between a fake item and a real item? This is the back of the palette. It's a metal palette. Looks just exactly like, as far as I know, the real one. So let me know that. You know the the actually the pigmentation isn't too bad. It um, kicks up a lot of powder, but you know a lot of even the real good ones have a lot of kick up. So anyway. Um, the next item I'm wearing today is my Urban Decay. It's kind of an Urban Decay week. And it's in Rush. And it is gorgeous. I love this color. It is pretty much a Connie color. I love this color. Okay, so that was Rush. That is my makeup for today. I will see you tomorrow. And have a good day. Bye. Good morning, this is Connie, and welcome to my Tuesday edition of Making It Work. I am sitting here in my bra. <laughs> I figured, you know, what's a lot of ladies wear strapless shirts when they film. They wear tank tops when they film. Why not? You're not going to see any lower than this anyway, right? So I'm going to go ahead and tell you what I wore today. I'm having a heck of a time with this eye this morning. Um, first swipe of mascara, I'm, as you know, I'm using the Smashbox. Um, that's not it. 
Anyway, it's in here. Smashbox something um, mascara. And it is so wet that the first time I went to put it on, I got it in my eye and I blinked and I had it everywhere. I mean, look at this tissue. My eyes were watering black. <laughs> what a mess, i tell you what. Anyway, what I'm wearing today is... I'm not going to go through everything else until Friday again because you already saw what I'm wearing for the week. So I'm just going to go through the things that I'm changing up. And I told you yesterday about that mirror. There it is. I do not think it's real because it's a foggy mirror. Now, tell me other ways that you can tell a fake from a, a real. Now, this is not bad, though. If it is fake, it's not a bad fake. This is what I wore for my um, base color today. This is what I wore for my transition. I'll wear that all week long. And then I wore this one on my eyes today. Okay, and then I, I wore my lip pencil, which I didn't yesterday. And this is in Rock and Rose. pretty much the same color as my lips because it's really hard to even see it on my lips once I have it applied. And then I'm wearing the Urban Decay um, met metallicized lipstick in Trance. This is what it looks like. And there we go. I love it. Just enough shine. Not too much shine, but it's enough. And I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Let me know if you mind me sitting here in my bra. Um, if, if you wouldn't know, you'd think, well, is she sitting there in a tank top? Is that, or is it too weird? Let me know. Good talk morning, everybody, and welcome to Wednesday edition of Making It Work. And let's get right into it. I'm cold this morning, so I want to get my robe on. So, anyway, um, for my eyes this week, I am using my Naked 2. We've already talked about this. Stupid mirror. And I am using this for my base. Um, where am I? This one for my, this one for my transition color, and today I used this color. Now, my eye looks look extremely alike this week. This, this palette has got just maybe one step in between each color. So I'm getting... You know, I went from this, then I went this, and then I went this. And Thursday and Friday, I'll wear between these three. Or even maybe this one. Not sure yet. But they do look extremely alike this week. I do like the colors, and the uh, base and the transition aren't the most pigmented colors. But the, the eyelid one goes on very well. So, you know, I'll continue using it. For my lips today, I wore my um, lip liner, and then I'm wearing the Metallic Liquid Lipstick by Wet n Wild in Peony Express. And I'm wearing some of my palette, or Project Pan pal, or stuff today. And today I'm wearing my um, Torina Tarantino blush in this shade. So that is it for my Wednesday edition. I will see. I have two more, or actually three full days to work, and then I have a week off. So I'm actually looking very forward to it. I don't know why. I, you know, it's just I don't know. 
because <laughs> I like my job and I like the people I work with, but I'm I'm looking forward to maybe a rest with my back or maybe solving some issues um, with, you know, um, having some meetings with my voc rehab person, whatever, um, finding out the results of my um, psychologist study thing, that kind of stuff. So I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Good morning, everybody, and happy Thursday. And this is Thanksgiving Day at my job. So we are making uh, turkey and all the fixings for our students, our staff, uh, our maintenance workers, whatever, today. Um, it's going to be a crazy, crazy, crazy busy day. It, I'm going to work until at least 5 at the late, at the earliest I'll get off at is 5 or 5.30, I would guess. And then we get to eat. So it'll probably be 6.30 or so by the time I get home. So it's going to be a very long day, a very stressful day, and I hope my back holds up. That's all I got to say. <laughs> because it's... You know, it, it seems like it's getting a little bit better, but I've been taking um, two a leave in the morning along with my muscle relaxer. And then at lunchtime, which is uh, 1.15 in the afternoon, then I take I take the first ones at 8, and then I take two more leave and another uh, muscle relaxer at 1.15. And the morning ones last me until about noon, and then I start really feeling it. And... In the afternoon, they, it doesn't hardly seem to touch it. So I don't know what's going on there. But by the afternoon, my back is pretty much wore out. <laughs> if I could just afford to work mornings, I'd be good. Right? Anyway, I left my hair down this morning. Um, so you can kind of see my haircut, how long it is and stuff. Usually it's, it's back by now, which I'll do right now. Put it behind my ears and then I've got an itty bitty tiny ponytail back here. But that itty bitty tiny ponytail keeps my headband in place. Otherwise, I don't know whether my, my head is too flat or too round or whatever back there that it, my headbands always slide up. So, anyway, um, for today... I wore the same old, same old base and the same old, same old transition because everything else is shimmer. And then today I wore this one on my eyelid. And these colors are so similar. This one's a little bit darker. You know, I, I love the colors in here. And, you know, the, the transition and the base are not real pigmented. But the shimmers seem to work very well on my lids. So, so you know, I'm, I'm okay with this palette. Okay, and for my lips today, I wore my Urban Decay in Back Talk. Which is this color. And it's like the perfect mauve, you know. It's just such a pretty color. I really like it a lot. I, again, forgot to use my lip liner, which I do about every other day. <laughs> anyway, I will talk to you tomorrow morning and tell you my thoughts on everything that I used all week. Bye-bye. Good morning, everybody. This is Connie. I am extremely tired. I went to sleep at 9 o'clock last night, woke up at midnight, was up until 3.30, and then um, slept for two hours. So... I tell you what, this not being able to sleep a full night is starting to get to me. Anyway, I we have got a snowstorm going on. We've Right now I looked out my door and it looks like we have four or five inches. Uh, we were supposed to get three to five and I think that we are, we are in that range because it looks kind of deep out there and it looks like whiteout conditions because the wind is really blowing hard 
So um, I still have to go to work because there's still students at the school. So I need to get out and clean my car off and scrape my windows because it, it rained and it sleeted and then it snowed. So you know what that means. So let's get going. Um, I used my Brow Stylist Plumper by L'Oreal today or this week. And I got to say, I really like it. Really like it. It's a little bit wet, but I can work with that with my brows. Um, it's got the long, long handle on it, which I really like a lot. I like that much better than the really short ones. You know, most of them are like about like this. And, um, yeah, I really like it. Okay, and then you guys know that I love my Ulta Eye Primer. I used, um, I didn't, I forgot to use it again today, but I used, for part of the week, I used my Jordana Easy Liner in Rock and Roll. For lip liner. Used my Body Ography Blush in Torch, I think. Calypso, sorry. Just a really pretty blush. I kind of like um, the stuff I've gotten from Bodyography. And then I used my L'Oreal Lumi, True Match Lumi in Ro Rose for a highlighter. And I just swirled my brush all over in that. I love that. It's very, very pretty on the skin. I used my Smashbox mascara, and I'm leaving it open a little for the saf or I don't know. Maybe I should just close it and leave it open for a couple hours during the weekend. But it is so wet that my lashes clump horribly, and I hate that. And I really thought I liked this um, Smashbox X rated before when I tried it. Maybe it wasn't the X rated. I don't know, but um, I thought I really liked it before. I'm not a fan now, but I need to dry it out some, and I think that it would work well if I dried it out some. Okay, so this week I used my Naked 2 by Urban, K Urban Decay, and full disclosure, I think it's fake. And the whole reason I think it's fake, I won this in a giveaway oh, a year and a half, two years ago. But um, was the mirror. I threw the mirror out because it, it wouldn't hold no matter what I did. It was a foggy mirror. And Urban Decay doesn't come out with foggy mirrors. You know, and there was no film over the top or anything like that to make it foggy. So um, that's the whole reason. I want to know what you guys say. How can you tell? Okay. So I use this on my lids as I did all week. I used this one on my for my transition as I did all week and I used this one today for my lid. Very similar looks all week but I really I mean that's the kind of colors I'm drawn to so okay for my lips I used I'm hurrying because I got to get out there and do this but um, I used matte bittersweet and I really, really, really toned it down. I tried putting some of um, L'Oreal's Julianne's Noon on top, and it didn't make any difference. So I just patted it until it was a very light shade, because this is really dark and kind of in-your-face uh, purplish pink. And for my job, it's just too much. Otherwise, it would have been fine, but for my job, it was way too much. So that is my least favorite lipstick of the week. The rest of them worked just fine. I used, it was an Urban Decay kind of week. You know, I used um, two of the Vice and then, or two of the Vice and then this one, which is, they're older and I, I think this is a cream lipstick because the this one here is the black is the matte. <laughs> Buddy's rolling around on the bed trying to get my attention. And then um, Wednesday I used the Wet n Wild that is in my, um, what you call it, in my Project Pam Roulette. All right, guys, that's my week. I will talk to you 
uh, next week I am off so we will be skipping a week of this so um, today the, this is going up on Sunday uh, you won't get one next Sunday but I'll do maybe a couple of get ready with me's to take take the place of it so I will talk to you guys later bye bye